the reason one of the reasons why I'm making this video today is to help somebody to deal with a phobia. Fear. How to overcome phobia. What is phobia? Fear. You fear height. You fear darkness. You fear the boogeyman. I'm here today to 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 encourage you of how to get rid of a phobia. Phobia is a fear, it's a torment, it's a torture. I'm giving you free lessons, my friend. I'm not a therapist, but I'm a man of God. I want you to overcome keeping lights on. Turn it off, turn the light off, go to bed. You hear voices, rebuke, it's nothing but the devil, my friend. The devil playing games with your mind. That's why the Bible said, let this mind be in you, which was in Christ Jesus. So if you're a person that's suffering, with a phobia, I want you to take a stand. If you're trying to get to heaven, you gotta move cowardness. If you're trying to get to heaven, you gotta move unbelieving, believing, unbelief, unbelief is a sin. So I'm here today to help you to, in, to overcome a phobia. Yes, to overcome fear. To overcome fear. Fear is a torment. Fear is a torture. Fear make you lose your mind. That's why the Bible says, let this mind, the battle of your mind, it's all in your head. Hey, glory to God, because it's not there. And when Joshua died, when Moses died, God have commanded Joshua, and I'm commanding you today to overcome a phobia. How you come, how you overcome a phobia? You overcome a phobia with the word of God. The more you study the word of God, the more, the more a phobia will fall off. A phobia, you're afraid. You're afraid of height. You're afraid of spaceness. You're afraid, you're afraid of social gathering. Hallelujah. So the Bible says in Joshua, listen, in Joshua, let's say glory to God. The, the eighth verse, Joshua chapter one, verse eight and nine. He say, this book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth. Hey, glory to God. But thou shalt meditate. Meditate means to, mm, you constantly, not to yoga, not to being a, a posture of, um, no. We talk about meditate in a day and stay in the word of God. There in day and night, that thou may pro observe to do according to all that is written therein. Hallelujah. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous and thou shalt have good success. Have not I command thee? If you are a Christian, God have commanded us the word of God. And I, don't, I never understand. The Bible says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. Why would you seek things first and don't seek God? So if you are if you are a person that are fearful, you need to get in the word of God because the Bible says, Fear not, little children. My gift is to give you the kingdom. So fear. A phobia, for a phobia, my friend. So the Bible says, my friend, listen, Bible say, have not a command thee, be strong. How you be strong? Let the weak say, I'm strong. Hey, glory to God. You're strong. Glory to God. The Bible says, not by power, nor by might, but by my spirit, say the Lord. So the spirit of God make you strong. It's not according to physical, because the Bible says, the letter, the, the, the letter, the letter kill it. But a spirit make alive. The Bible say, a little body exile profit little, but godliness profit all. So I don't understand people. Let's spend more time in the gym and less time with God. Hey, glory to God. The more time, the more time you spend with God, it will give you a confidence of this very thing. He that begot a good work in you will perform it until the day of Jesus Christ. So how to overcome a phobia? You gotta stay in the word of God. You gotta walk in the word of God. The Bible say, they do they don't walk in the shadow of the, the shadow of death, I fear no evil. So it's a shadow. The fear you have is a shadow. Hey, glory to God. And the Bible, my friend, it's your it's your weapon to, to face your fear. It's time to face your fear. Look your the fa fear in the eye. Say, I'm not afraid of you. You just you just you just a worn line seeking whom he may devour. How to overcome a phobia? You gotta face your fear. Don't be scared. Don't be a, don't be a scaredy cat. Be a lion. Don't be a pigeon. Be an eagle. Hey, glory to God. So the Bible says, 
have not I command thee, be strong and of good courage. Courage. You got to have courage. Hey, glory to God. Com courage is confident. Confident not in you, but confident in God. Greater is he that's in you than he that's in the world. How to come, how to overcome, hallelujah, a phobia? Three W's. Hey, glory to God. You got to walk in God. Hey, glory to God. You got to be in God's will. You got to worship God. David said, I will bless the Lord at all times. <laughs> Not sometimes, all the time. So if you're trying to overcome a phobia, you got to walk. Walk with God. Don't walk with fear. Walk with faith. Hey, man. I'm telling you, stop stop giving a therapist all your money trying to conquer fear. Glory to Job say the things are greater fear has come upon me. Face your fear. Look fear in the eyes and say, I'm not afraid of you. Hey, glory to God. Look the witch in the eye and say, I'm not afraid of you. Glory to God. Put your spell because your spell will not prosper. Hallelujah, I tell people, hey, if you're trying to overcome a phobia, if you're trying to overcome a snake, you're trying to overcome, hallelujah, a spiders, the dark, hallelujah. Some people love the dark. Some people love the light. Some people love the dark. How can you love the dark, my friend? Hallelujah. How can you love the light? I hope you love the light of Jesus. Hey, glory to God. But you, you scared of the dark. Hallelujah. The Bible says, he ain't not giving the spirit of fear, but of power. The power to tread on serpent over the power over your enemy and nothing by any means hurt you. We got to stay in the word. And the other, the other W is the word of God. Hey, walk the will, worship and the word of God. We got to be in the word of God. Ah, how to overcome a phobia? We got to be in the word of God. Because the word of God is our weapon. That's the other W, the weapon of our warfare. They're not carnal. It's not a carnal. Oh, you don't kill the devil with guns. You don't kill the devil with baseball bat. You don't kill the devil by cussing him out. You kill the devil, and you can't kill the devil anyway because the devil is a spirit. You, you fight the devil with the word of God. Amen. Hey, Jesus Christ gave the, the devil the word. It is written, Satan. It is written, Satan, and thou shalt worship God. Him only shalt thou serve. So I'm telling you, if you are a Christian, you shouldn't have a phobia. Hallelujah. If you are a child of God, you shouldn't have a phobia. Go to bed. Hey, glory to God. It's just in your mind. That's why the Bible said, let this mind be in you, which was in Christ Jesus. It's all in your mind. Don't let the devil play in your mind. So, so God told Joshua, have not I command thee? It's a command. Hey, glory to God. Be strong and, and be of good church. Be courage. Be not afraid. Be not a be not a, be not a cat. Be a lion. Be not a pigeon. Be a bird. Be an eagle. Hey, glory to God. Neither be thou dismayed, for the Lord thy God is with thee wheresoever thou goest. God said, I'll never leave you, nor forsake you. I'll be with you always until the end of time. So how to overcome a phobia? Four W's, my friend. You got to walk with God. You got to be in God's will. You got to worship God. You got to be in his, his word and a weapon of warfare. They're not carnal, but they're mighty through God, pulling down a straw hole. We wrestling against flesh and blood, but against principality, rules of darkness of this world, spiritual wickedness in high places. You overcome a phobia with those W with the four W's I mentioned. You're gonna walk with God. Stop walking with the devil. Hey man, stop walking with the devil. Stop walking with flesh. Walk in the spirit. And the Bible says these are contrary one to one another. When I'm trying to do good, evil is always present. Oh wretched man that I am, who shall deliver me of this body of this death? This body is a death trap. That's why we need the word of God. Every day of our life, we got to meditate in the day and night. Hallelujah. When you don't feel like reading the word, read the word of God. When you feel like praying, pray. Because push, pray until something happens. How to overcome a phobia.